درت ما احنا هيدا اللي رفعت اوف ممكن كنت نفتكر اوزر لكن وغير كالدي ناو هذي اللات سايدر هذي اللات سايدر So we didn't learn whether we get points. Sometimes the dust spawn new enemies, but the alert is over like that. The number above the head just gives you an idea of how difficult they are doing. more help can survive a little bit longer let's go to the next mission then yeah so it's a random timings I think uh, also we've got level 3 clearance now let me actually check a few doors so in the central executive southwest lower floor corner this level 3 door. So, central objective. I think it was over there. The situation is getting worse. I saw Trench and Darling arguing a couple weeks ago. Over there, that one over there. Loops. Spin and gripping efficiency. Okay. Ooh, there we go. Oh, there's... America overnight result. The America Overnight program has operated successfully for over blank years, originally designed to assist in providing this information to the naturally skeptical population of America. It has additionally led to the discovery of numerous AWEs and altered materials by allowing civilians to call in and report their experiences with the paranatural. In fact, America Overnight alerted the Bureau of Blank and Blank in its first year of operation alone. In this report, the investigations sector have catalogued and categorized each episode of America Overnight that has resulted in a successful bureau investigation in order to help AWE occurrence analysis. The more blank results of Night Springs have also been catalogued in a separate report. Refer to the file blank for full reports. Compiled by Remy Dennis, Chief Investigator, by order of Director Zachariah French. Okay. Cool, uh, I will let this down. Check if there's a level 3, another level 3 door on my list. No, the next few are level 4s. So god. Find Marshall in research paramecology. Which you need to go sector elevator so weapon mods uh, this is a spin gripping efficiency Ooh, a level 3 mod Pers oh we've got a second personal slot hold on uh, so this one was Oh, never mind. Uh, launch energy costs. Let's turn these two. So, evade energy cost, energy recovery speed, health recovery per element pickup, or energy plus 7%. So, this one is just generally more health. Mm -hmm. 
more energy or launch energy cost deduction. Mm. I don't evade enough to make um, this worthwhile energy recovery speed, maybe. Or we'll use more launch. Or this. this one. Okay, let me just check this. Um, his troopers shatter headshot tactics. Actually, to change my weapon type, so I use more shatter. Hiss resonance, negating it. Saying something? Oh, I'm sick of that elevator. We need to go to research. Research sector. Yeah, so we were in maintenance. But we've now got research and containment sector on that. Service weapon forms share the same ammunition resource. If it is depleted, use your abilities while it recharges. Research. research. Ah, multimedia research sector. Ah, it's that. thought this video would make for great internal communications. I'm looking at you, Mr. Tomasi. So, this is where the magic happens. Anyway, I I've been here for 24 years now. I I've always been here. And, and through those years, we've made astonishing discoveries, authored studies of great importance. And in all this work, there is one thing we know, and that's how little we truly know. Rest assured, we're committed to keep pushing the known laws and borders of reality, and to make the Bureau proud. So, welcome. Assuming you have the necessary clearance, and, and do follow the safety protocols. Read the manual. Otherwise, bad things will happen. Research sector, huh? Home of the Bureau's mad scientists. I think the way I'm going to try and do this is when I go into unknown areas or around corners I'm going to use my shatter in long range like open areas like this I use the, the grip Someone music doesn't hasn't stopped it. Oh, 
Fishing line. Cool. Where are they? Behind me? What's over there? Over there? Someone's around somewhere. A bit there. Hey. Ah, over there. Whoa, okay. Sniper. When his beam starts hitting me, I need to go, I need to hide. Very far away there. Goodness. Okay, there's more enemies now. That's one of those guys. Oh! I did that wrong. I've got like one health left or whatever that is. <laughs> can't actually take chances like this. I can't perceive any. Well, okay, there is someone there. Okay, spawning new enemies. Spawning new enemies. Agents. Oh, got more health than usual. Cover's blown. <laughs> but <laughs> I 
Where is he? Oh, he's back there. Oh, it's not the same guy. I heard the incoming rocket, man. <laughs> well, and then the music stops. Very near the end. Ooh. That was a bit too close, man. so big though. I don't want to get stuck outside in the open. Searching around for loot. I think there's an access point or a stabilization point here somewhere. Or a faster travel point. Control point. That's the word I was looking for. Control point. Dodge efficiency. For a quick look around, so I can get loot somewhere. Any files? Hidden goodie. Astro blip. Emergency call summary. Oh, look at that. Collectibles. Multimedia. Research sector, that's the one we saw on the entrance when we came in. Okay, so. Excuse me. Emergency call summary. A possible AWE 18 in which an unnamed individual experienced transcorporeality via phone line. Event is notably similar to AWE blank, in which blank, blank, event response event is believed to have been caused by blank, blank, and, and, and as a result of the following measure. And as a result, the following measures have been taken to prevent blank, 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 blank. AW18, event date 1993. Okay. Research and records. His sniper. That's the guys with the beams. Specializing in, in, in eliminating threats from a distance using the telltale searchlights affixed to their rifles to search for targets. These snipers are no less lethal, the corruption has not changed their tactics, they clearly prefer to maintain a good distance from their targets, waiting in elevated positions for a clear shot. Care should be taken in open spaces, check the balconies, I should note that their rifles are equipped with a bayonet for close quarters combat and the HIS snipers are well aware of how to use it. I refer to file blank for full report. Okay. Let's check for the other stuff. Assets, we've got intrusive pattern, cat one research, cat one maintenance, cat three alerts, is a lin train missions. Check this upstairs area. So we came in by that room and check these offices. Plant complaints. Correspondence. Plant complaints. Hey, so I was just wondering about the plants in your research. Is it really necessary to sing to them? I mean, that janitor does have a nice voice and the plants sure seem to like it. 
maybe you could just switch it up a bit. I'm getting pretty tired of the tank. And where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember when they were planted. And people like them a bit too much if you ask me. Are we being baited by houseplants? Worth looking into, Dr. Lewis. <laughs> else what in this one What's this hold on shoe box just this uh zooming it seems to make the light light up Ugh. some notes i think i've stumbled into something here only notes early hypothesis now for further test needed shoe box retrieved from ordinary Potential altered item, not flagged. AWE in the lab, everything affected but the shoebox and contents. We recreated the event, same result. We created with a different shoebox from home, same result. W T F. <laughs> Shoeboxes can't be altered. Contents, safe. Why, how? Loophole, we could use this. Who took the shoebox? We are in the middle of a test here, bring it back. Idiot. Summer 2012, ordinary AWE 2002. So the ordinary AWE was in 2002. So if we see something referencing that. Let's see that. Samantha. Reds. Depopulation ongoing in... Something. In toilet. <laughs> Block the house of dreams. FPC alerted. This house of dreams. Uh, contents point to Thomas Zane. Ref Bright Falls AWE 1970 summer. 2010 tall connected IWE. Just sort of little background snippet. These people change the shotgun at a closer range. That's more of a punch. Synchronicity. Synchronicity. Synchronicity is a phenomena long recognized by the wise but only recently given a name by science. It is how we rationalize events connected to by no identifiable causality yet clearly conjoined in purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? Why do hounds bail at the death of their master, which has occurred miles away? The world is unified in ways we do not yet understand, and sometimes we stumble across these invisible unseen chords and wonder at the result. The visionary Carl Jung laid the road, now we must walk it. My fledgling research department will make it our mission to reliably reproduce blank behavior by the close of 1959. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science. History may not remember our names, but God himself will. Refer to file blank for full report. By Dr. Theodore Ash, Head of Research. Authority of not anyone. <laughs> so Theodore Ash is a previous research director. Okay. Those rooms we access later. Or even up there. Oh no. <laughs> There's stairs going there. Not everything has to be accessed later. Dr. Darling's office. Multimedia HRAs. Oh. I've been fielding questions recently regarding HRAs. What are they for? Do you always need to wear them? And what's the deal with the headroom resonance anyway? <laughs> I think that's worse for wear. Despite what you may have heard, HRAs are not monitoring devices. They're not tracking your movements or listening to your conversations while you're wearing them. 
We do that regardless whether or not you're wearing <laughs> an HRA. We do that anyway. Think of them as uh, as a uh, life preserver. Only instead of water, the the thing HRAs protect you from is um, classified. <laughs> One day that classified, not water, might pour in and. You'll be glad you got a got an HRA keeping you afloat. And if you don't have an HRA, don't worry. It'll be uh, quick and painless. <laughs> kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. It won't be quick and painless. More. Okay. Cool. Lots of files in here. Resonance theory. So we just got this multimedia one, HRAs, yeah. Uh, resonance theory. Resonance, it's there but we can't see it. It vibrates around us, through us, from us. But what if the vibration is conscious? What could a force like that do? Blank, open the door to a blank. I've called the blank, the blank emits a force that is far beyond the forces we've previously dealt with. It has shown me so much that I have to wonder. Is resonance the key element in all altered phenomena? AWEs, altered items, objects of power, do they share a common blank that we've yet to discover? We can harmonize control points. What else would the correct frequency allow us to achieve? What if resonance has been the answer this whole time? Refer to file blank for full report. Compiled by Dr. Casper Darling, head of research by order of NA. Number five. Balling, balling, da darling, budget request. Dear Dr. Darling, I suspect my colleague Dr. Hansen has already contacted you asking for an increase in her department's budget. I'm not surprised. Parapsychology has always been a squeaky wheel, all fuss but no results. Parakinesiology has always been the stronger department. More breakthroughs, more tangible data, more usable research. I'm sure a man of your esteem can plainly see which department is more deserving of the budget increase. Just think what those additional resources could do for an already formidable research team. Anyway, I know you're a fan of single malt, so I left the bottle of well aged and brown on your desk. Yours in admiration, Abram Lewis. <laughs> to see, darling, from a Lewis subject, parakinesiology budget. Classified. Stuck on this wall. <laughs> and we are in a dream. This feels like those uh, Inception stuff. I can just read this collectibles. Uh, what is this? Astral Plane. The Bureau has spent years studying why objects of power transport users into the astral plane when touched. My predecessor, Dr. Ash, theorized that a potential receptacle determined by Jungian archetypes in a collective subconscious would be inhabited by paranatural energies when an AWE occurred in its vicinity, creating an altered item. Over time, a link was created by the blank and the astral plane to that item, making it an object of power. So many additional theories have been raised since Dr. Ash's time. Objects of power placed on Earth as tests by some astral entity. Our dimension was once a part of the astral plane. And the objects were left behind as its borders receded. The astral plane was an early threshold into the oldest house, but the connection was severed and now the two are linked solely through the objects of power. I will attempt to disprove some of these in order to thin the herd. Hopefully the truth will emerge. Refer to file 6-32-64984 for full report. Compiled by Dr. Casper Darling, Head of Research. By order of none. Okay. Just getting a timer. I'm going to take a short break before we do this mission. Uh, I'm also going to make myself a chocolate. Scene is 3.